John Gall in car number 81 from Bannister, Michigan, southwest of Saginaw on the inside of row three, car number 81. Mark Brofman in 52 from Hillsdale. Eric Curry in the Gypsum Supply West, car number 5K from Martin. Bob Tobalski in car number 14. And he's from Quincy, Michigan. He was the rookie of the year at Butler Motor Speedway this year. Finished ninth in points. And Dean St. Dennis, Canadian driver, car number 64. First side heat, eight laps. Here we go. Dustin Daggett in car number 85 gets the early jump. Greg Dahlman second. Mark Steeman running third. And Mark Brockman goes fourth. The round to complete lap one. Straightaway lead, Dustin Daggett, Greg Dahlman second, Mark Steeman third, Mark Brofman fourth, John Gall running fifth. Justin Daggett way up high out of turn four. Four laps complete, four to go. Greg Dahlman running second. Mark Steeman third. Mark Brofman fourth. John Gall fifth. John Gall in car number 81 with the smoke from the motor. Back to the pit area, white flag, one to go for your leader, Dustin Daggett. Greg Dahlman in the 49T running second, Mark Steeman third, and Mark Brofman fourth. Dustin Daggett wins it convincingly. Greg Dahlman in the 49T, running second. Greg Dahlman second, Mark Steeman third, Mark Brofman fourth. And uh, two years in a row now, he's won the King of Michigan side at Nationals here at Hartford Speedway Park. Just turned 20 years of age on Thursday, Dustin Daggett. No longer a teenager. Back on July 5th, the King of Michigan 360 side nationals event. Darren Long in car number seven, the winner at South Buxton, Ontario, Canada last Saturday night. And for the second time this year, won the event there earlier this year. Len Robinson in the 9R, Barry Roscoe in 87, Billy Krupp in 41, Jim Wolfie on the 3W, Jim Payne in the 134A, and Dane Nida in car number 54. Jim Wolfield tapping the wall between one and two. Attention in the pit area, we need that gloss dash to the staging area, we need the gloss dash to the make ready shoot. Tim Hunter, your leader. Darren Long running second, car number seven. Ronnie Beal third. Mike Dussel in car number 85 running fourth. And a good battle for fifth. 
Billy Krupp up to fifth on the inside, getting by Barry Roscoe. Good battle for fifth. Dane Knight on the move on the inside in car number 54. Barry Roscoe up high. Former SOD champ, Dane Nida in car number 54. Tim Hunter, your leader in car number two, Darren Long second. Ronnie Beal in the 3B. Mike Dussel running fourth in car number 85. Leader getting the white flag, Tim Hunter in turn two. Lots of traffic up in front of him. Darren Long giving chase in the seven car, running second. Tim Hunter, your winner in the two car. Darren Long second, car number seven. Ronnie Beal third. Mike Dussel, check out the battle for sixth here out of turn four. Dane Knight in 54, Billy Krupp in 41. What a battle from about fifth on back. Dane Knight of 54, Billy Krupp in 41. Here's your winner, Tim Hunter from Millersburg, Ohio. Ronnie Beal, Greg Dahlman in 49T, Mike Dussel in 85, 17S Mark Steeman in 85, Dustin Daggett, Tim Hunter in two, Darren Long in seven, Tim, Cur Tim Curry, Eric Curry in the 5K. Too many Currys. Dane Knight in 54, Bob Tobolsky in 14, Billy Krupp in 41, Dean St. Dennis, Jim Wolfield. Barry Roscoe, Len Robinson, here we go. Bob Tobolsky in car number 14, flipping on the back straight away. And Dwayne Medlin climbing out in the 9M down on the low side. A-OK, -okay. Bob Tobolsky, A-OK, -okay. we just got the word. Between 85, Dustin Daggett and the 49T of Greg Dahlman. Len Robison in the 9R, flipping down in between turns one and two. Again on our first lap of the 25. Landing upright in our track safety crew quickly on the scene once again. And Mike Anker who heads up our track safety crew once again over the radio with a driver's A-OK -okay signal. And Len is out of the car down there, A-OK. -okay. Len Robison from Spring Arbor in the 9R. We will start single file. Mark Broffman leads him to green. Here we go once again. Mike Dussel getting by Greg Dahlman up to third.
Dustin Daggett getting by Greg Dahlman, now running fourth. Greg Dahlman side by side with Mark Steeman for fifth. drivers running first and second. Dustin Daggett on the move, running third in car number 85. St. Dennis tapping the wall, spinning over in turn two, car number 64 to bring out the yellow with three laps complete. Mike Dussel way up on the high side, ready to lead him back to green. Here we go out of turn four. Dustin Daggett working up the second, getting by Ronnie Beal. Darren Long now sixth in car number seven. Tim Hunter on the move in car number two. Now running fifth as they work their way by Mark Brofman. Greg Dahlman nearly spinning in turn two in the 49th team. for the lead right here out of turn four. The 285 cars, Mike Dussel, Dustin Daggett. Ronnie Beal running third in the 3B. Darren Long now running fourth in car number seven, trying to get by. Tim Hunter now up to third in car number two. Justin Daggett to the inside, drifting up the track. Mike Dussel in the white number 85 and the blue 85. Dustin Daggett running second now to the low side. Tim Hunter running third in car number two, 11 laps complete.
Dussel continues to lead in the white 85. The blue 85, Dustin Dagg in second. 16 laps complete, nine to go. Tim Hunter, your third place car, car number two. Darren Long running fourth. One and two, Darren Long on the high side, getting by Tim Hunter. Lyons, the crew chief on the car, the driver from Rising Sun, Ohio, drove the black number six the last time they were here. And the other number 85, Dustin Daggett, finishing second. Darren Long had a good battle there in car number seven. Good battle for third. Darren Long finishing third. Tim Hunter, another Ohio driver, finishing fourth. Mark Steeman, fifth. And Ronnie Beal, your side champion, finishing sixth in the 3B. Greg Dahman, seventh in the 49T. And Dane Knight in car number 54, finishing eighth. Hey, 
Michigan race fans, how about it one more time for this Buckeye driver, Mike Dussel, your winner tonight, car number 85. opportunity race fans we work with this gentleman now for the last four years Dwayne Turner sod president gonna be stepping down after this year how about a hand for Dwayne Turner at the job he does with the sprints on dirt Mike Dussel I was talking to you back there in the pit area before the races started tonight, and I said, you know, I got the old wireless, might have to get it out here and might be talking to you. And you said you enjoy racing on the big half mile. Congratulations, nice job. And you were riding up on the, the high side with the cushion. Yeah, this car, man, we, we didn't hit it very good in the heat race, and we tightened her up a little bit and jumped up there above that cushion, and this car was flying. I really got to thank Randy Curlis and Jason Curlis of Curlis Motorsports for giving me the opportunity to drive this car tonight. I like the... Uh, thank the side officials. They're really great every time we come up here. I love this Hartford track. Um, looking forward to coming back again. Mike, we got to talk a little bit about uh, the Ohio Adventures running down there at uh, KC, Attica, Fremont, Eldora on the other big half mile. And race fans, we're pleased to welcome this driver here tonight. He is not only top dog in Michigan tonight, but he is by golly about the best 360 sprint car driver in the whole state of Ohio. He won the NRA championship this year. Yeah, we had a great season. Uh, won a few features. We were consistent all year in the top five. Uh, we won that championship. We got second in the Lima local championship, third at Eldora's local championship. It was just a great year. And uh, the rest of those, the competition, not chop lever. Darren Long had a good battle going on with Tim Hunter, and we'd have kind of liked to see maybe uh, Mike Linder and Bobby Clark here tonight, too. Kyle Sauter. Yeah, uh, we race all year with Darren and a lot with Tim Hunter, and uh, I really like racing with all them guys. Um, just looking forward to keep on doing this. All right, Mike, congratulations. Good job. Thanks a lot.